or whatever. Okay. Five total. Or whatever, that's not bad. You with mean a four pieces? Person game. No, no, not, not five oh, okay. pieces. Five, like, individual squares on a piece. Gotcha. Yeah. I usually try to get rid of those immediately unless I see a really stellar. I try thing. to get rid of all my fives and then my fours. I try to go down that way. Is and the, I, is and the meta try, strategy yeah. to invade or is it to keep in your area? I think, okay, what I tried this last weekend. And there were there were some pretty smart people, I guess, but uh, not really familiar with the game. Yes. But I tried I tried this weekend to like make it so that they really couldn't get any pieces in my spot. Like make like stick to my area, but also spread out, but stay as compact as possible. Gotcha. You know, so like they would kind of like leave their area open where I could get my smaller pieces in there, but they really couldn't. Like I didn't really leave them too much, you know, room to squeeze in. <laughs> this this guy knows the Uncle Funkle. <laughs> Uncle Funkle. Yeah, dude, Uncle Funkle, dude. <laughs> Uncle Funkle. Why does it sound so familiar, Uncle Funk? It's actually from a YouTube poop. Oh, is it? And like, <laughs> was I listening to the stream and you said that before? Is that yeah, why that's familiar? Yeah, probably. Okay. okay. He like puts his arm around Will. He's like, I know Will puts his arm around uh, Uncle Phil, and he's like, "Woman is a trip, Uncle Funkel." <laughs> Uncle Funkel. <laughs> but right now we have the game you guys have been waiting for, starting on Lilat of all stages. Yeah, I don't know what this is. I like, I hate Lilat, but some people are really good on it, man. Uh, and that, well, I'm, I, Pikachu's really good on it. Yeah. Uh. Well, it, didn't the um. Uh. What was it? The. Uh, the canceling or whatever. Yeah. With Pikachu or whatever. That got that got patched out, but it's still Pikachu is really good on the stage. Well, you can do it on all the tilting parts. Oh, it. okay. So okay. anywhere it's like tilting, and uh, yeah, and the, when it's oh. while it's tilting, you can do it on, like I think on the whole stage. Okay. Not too sure, but. Yeah, definitely the tilt and Lilat. I've seen some zany things. Yeah. Happen nice word. Because nice of word. It. Yeah. Zany. Yeah. Okay. It's been a while since we've heard Zany and thrown out there. Let's see that. <laughs> Um, oh, nice forward smash by uh, Swanky, actually stuffing Smasher's own forward smash, which comes out very, very quickly. Yeah, he's like, stop that. He just threw an up smash out. You know what I, I noticed a lot in, um, okay, in, in this doubles play between, because I play Swanky and Chris a lot. A lot of times Swanky sticks to the ground and Chris kind of sticks to the air, mm -hmm. you know, and, and Chris is always ready to follow up off of a grab from Swanky. Which I really like, because, I mean, their characters themselves, Diddy Kong fares well on the ground and... You know, well, you can't fare on the ground. They like, can't forward air yeah. while you're grounded, but like, you yeah, know, it works super well. well. Yoshi has like extremely good aerial mobility, and uh, Diddy can always get a grab. Diddy can almost always get a grab, you know? So he gets the grab. Yoshi can fly in, into the zone with an up air so, or whatever, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically, anything they want. Back throw! Gonna do it, and uh, Kip Dog surviving. That was smart of Swanky to go above the ledge there. Um, oh, what's the water though. for? Hello? You're trying to clean the ship that you're on? That a, ooh, ooh. Wow, he's alive! Oh. Oh, no. That Pikachu. That down smash, yeah. Oh, and that, uh, then that up that air. Up air, yeah, okay. really good so, up air. Swanky usually does play uh, stock tank. And yes. Smasher is usually, I want to say, more of the aggressor. Wow! Chris! Chris just did 81% to Smasher. Oh, yeah. Like in like one, one string. One it was amazing. Aggro. Heck yeah, man. That's good, good stuff. Um, when uh, when Smasher teams with with Tech, I feel like I mean I think Smasher's the aggressor overall. But yeah. I think Kip Dog plays a little bit more of an aggressive style than Tech, who also is like a static partner with Smasher. Right. Yeah. The, so, but I've seen I've seen I've seen Smasher and Kip like do the craziest of stuff where they'll like grab, throw up, footstool into so like right. a double forward smash. Yes, I have seen that yeah. as well. It's very very nice setups. Yeah, man. These guys are cousins. And then you got cousins versus brothers right now. Yeah, you do. Oh, Swanky gonna actually really hold the stock down, which is interesting. Like, when you hold your stock, like, the first time, you're like, man, I held that stock. And then if you lose the second one, you're like, dang, what happened? <laughs> yeah. And now Swanky finally, finally losing, losing it. it. Yeah, and uh, him holding that stock for a long time really gonna net him a lot because Smasher only has one stock left and actually getting juggled by a uh, blue team right now. Yeah, they're doing a really good job. Oh, back throw. Gonna send Yoshi off stage. And I like what he did right there. He just went right over, help out his teammate, and throw. Uh, get a throw so he can, you know, his teammate can go and capitalize on that. Yeah. All right, so the first <gasps> oh, no. Lilat. Okay. Yeah. Unfortunate. Kip Dog actually, like, looked at me and went, yeah, that happens sometimes. Let's get rid of Lilat already. That's just me, though. That's it. We are a cloud, okay? I I'm Pac-Man. I've like never had to be in the stage. I am a cloud, and I am bad on. I'm so bad on my life. But like, Mewtwo King loves uh, 
loves it. That was a good like little combo there where Kid yeah. Dog pummeled and held and then smash her up, smash. That's like classic. That's what you want to do. Yes. Uh, the whole the whole thing. Uh, yeah. A lot of characters with the good like back throws and down throws mm -hmm. are really interesting because like. Yeah. Then your partner can follow up if they're behind. Because if they're in front, you just got to go up there like up smash or forward smash. Oh, yeah. I think Mario is probably, in my opinion, a top 10 doubles character. Yeah, he's super I would say strong. for sure. Um, oh, trying to get a spot dodge read off of Chris, but instead, Burnt Eggs. All right, so this might not be too... Well, this is going to be a little bit hard for Smasher to bring this back with like that high of a percent, but they're only one stock down. If they can get the stock off Diddy here... It won't be as bad as long right. as they uh yeah. It's gonna be it's definitely rough. Play pretty safe. Play wow. pretty safe. Oh, so oh. he get a grab, but Chris actually not able to follow up yeah. because he wanted to he wanted to save him from Smasher. Really interesting play because it was like you make a decision and oh, uh, I, see. I actually think he made the wrong decision, I'm gonna be honest. I think so too. I actually thought when he was doing that, I see what you're saying, and that, that could definitely be the case. I thought he was thinking that Swanky was about to throw up, and so he's running oh, towards okay. him. But I could be completely wrong. And I think that, that that's another good choice that he wants to protect him after that. Right. I think getting the kill in that scenario yeah, was he better. Yeah, yeah he I think getting he the kill. should have solidified the stock. Because Diddy wasn't gonna die, he was at zero percent. Right. Yeah. Here we are, Chris and Swanky. You know what's funny is sometimes I forget who wins. Like, like, because I, I, I'm so focused on trying to say stuff. Yeah. And then like I'm like, oh shoot, who, ex right, who exactly game won? Two, they won. Game two, like, right? You yeah, just, yeah, like, yeah. Just refer to them so ambiguously. Like. Now what I do is I try to remember what music played, <laughs> oh. and I heard the Yoshi music, so I'm like, oh, Chris and Swanky won. Good job. That's good, dude. That is funny. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're like, yeah. They won, and we're going, we're going to game, game two. two. What are they going to ban? Yeah, what are they going to Yeah. We are completely ambiguous. That's hilarious. Yeah, I guess Travis does look different without his, his glasses. Doesn't he look super different? Yeah. Whoa, who's that? Yeah, whoa. Everyone says he's on handsome PR. I don't know. Travis? Yeah. Now that he's Actually, got, with the beard, it's better. I think I like him with the beard. He's definitely, he's definitely a sexier man with the beard. No Leon. doubt. Leon. I think Leon's a really good Leon, looking dude. You gotta check out but I would never say that to his face. I don't want him to feel good about himself. Nate! It's safe. So, dude. Vape, vape, dude, vape. Va dude, vape 520. Vape it. Vape it. Oh, Dakota's not here. We can get away with <laughs> Oh. I can't say the <laughs> thought I had. I'm really sorry. So Smasher okay. uh, switching to his Mega Man. Yeah, interesting, actually. Um, you actually usually... Oh, no! That's the backer going to lead to death onto the Swanker Manker. <laughs> yeah. Swanker and I think, I think with... You know, I don't know. But I think I honestly think with Smasher switching to Mega Man, I think he's, he's he wants to take a more stock tank role and, yeah. and be less aggressive and kind of just be... I'm going to save you. You can yeah. go aggro. I'm going to save you for my pellets. Now, um, interesting thing I was going to mention is uh, usually I, when I see a switch, Kip Dog switches to Villager. Yeah. His Villager's really, really strong. Oh, yeah, yeah. Those, that's definitely Kip Dog's two uh, best characters, Pikachu and Villager. And you'll see them stock tank. So interesting, interesting. Like, they can both be the aggressor and they can both be the stock tank. Really cool. Yeah. Now, uh, Chris is holding the stock really well. Well, I mean, you see the other other team members also have three stocks other yeah. than uh, Swanky. But Mega Man and Pikachu's stock can be taken. They're both really at kill fast. percent now. Yeah, and Yoshi's kind of there, but not completely there at kill percent. Like, you're going to have to get, like, a up tilt for Mega Man or uh, something really strong. Something really, really strong. Like a smash at the ledge. All right, there it goes. Oh, no, Pikachu's Pikachu's still not dead. I'm trying to use a fat Pikachu. Yeah, that, right. is, that is a chubby Pikachu. It's like that. It's like the first Pokemon Pikachu card that came out. You remember Pikachu with oh, no! that on there? That's not what you do. I he he just double jumped as Mega Man. Uh, he did the up air, and Chris double jumped into the Mega Man up air, and the wind box like he carried him, and he died. Oh yeah, yeah, that is real bad. That is super duper bad. Uh, I missed it. And now. And now we have a uh, red team with actually quite a uh, quite a nice lead. And a after they dropped game one, so you think the Mega Man switch really uh, it looks like it's really helping out. It definitely changed some things up. Um, and <gasps> oh wow, you see that? Yeah, I saw yeah. Regrall do that. 
definitely, yeah, looking like Regrawl out there, but even with the blue, blue uh, Yoshi. That is a smart, I mean, that's a smart thing, man. Get them off stage, and you know they're going to come out of there, and then just fair them. Just dunk them. I think I do think the Mega Man was a was a smart switch here. Yeah. But I think that Chris and Swanky can um, figure this team out. I think they kind of got gimped in some weird ways, like the Diddy Kong's first stock and Yoshi's first stock. No, yeah, I completely agree. And they're definitely not out of this game even. Oh yet. no, not even. Not even. They're definitely gonna make some adjustments. And then Kip Dog and Smash are playing super solidly. Look at that. Kip Dog with the up smash. Yeah, uh, Pikachu up smash. Not too slept down. Very very strong move there. I really like watching Smash vs. Mega Man. Maybe, it's actually really fun to watch. Yeah, maybe I'm biased. I love what he does with Metal Blade. No, I actually really like it. Some people, you know, say Smash just can't be in, like, really overly aggressive, but he, his I Mega think, Man's actually really I Dude, I think his Mega Man is like, it's like a magician, kind of. Like, watch this over here while he's, well, like, uh, yeah. he was about to do something Hey, else. what about my Pac-Man, sir? Yeah. My, my Pac-Man's definitely a magician. If, it, if that's a magician, I'm freaking Siegfried and Roy. <laughs> Six freedom Roy. Dude, my favorite is Penn and Teller. Penn and Teller, like yeah, I knew you were going to say it. I knew you were going to yeah, yeah. Of course, because those guys are so good. Those guys are so sick. good. Look at Ragnarok off there standing like Not a only that, but their philosophy is oh, really, yeah. really stellar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we know about that. <laughs> oh, Chris. Okay, he's making wow. it back. He, he, went, actually, he might have went like, almost as deep as he could have. He just ran up and up smash. He really wants that kill. He's falling in with those up airs, trying to take Mega Man stock still. Yeah, 172 is living. We hit a quarter, not gonna do it. Yeah, Mega Man is super heavy. He is. He's a robot, dude. But this honestly is not out. Look, look. Okay, so they get Pikachu stock here. Then they got the two v one situation. Yeah, the two v one. But then again, they take Diddy Kong stock. Ah, it's such a toss up. This is so close. It is a super toss up. I, and look, it looks like Kip Dog's oh almost stealing off uh, that stock. Yeah, any situation. If they kill the Pikachu, they kill the Diddy Kong. Yeah. It's 2v1, and then it's almost good night, you know? Like, these guys, I feel like both these teams work really well together. Oh, yeah, 100%. So and it's, here. like, super hard to beat them in a 2v1. Either one. Either oh, one. oh, Chris going in and Swinky going in for the follow-up. follow-ups, yeah. Really, really good. Pikachu offstage, you should have kind of maybe gone for Mega Man, but actually Swanky going on getting, getting the banana, and he's going to go and trip. <gasps> that egg almost killing. Hit him with the egg, dude. Oh, that's, that's up yeah. smash and well, that's not it. Oh, that thought, is okay, it. You don't bad. see the sparks, but they, that was a good comeback by them. They were actually down. They were, actually, yeah, they were. And then you saw it like pull together. That whole, that whole last thirty seconds was just like team hitting team. Like you, like they were like following up, following up, following up. So it was great. It was a great time. We all.